Uh, I did it again with another with a rapper, this dude named Troy Ave, and we did a song together. He, he's actually most famous for shooting up a club. This ain't like gonna be some rah rah motivational food. Quickly. A video testimonial about exogenous ketones, so I can add it to your landing page. So get Miguel to give what Alex needs. You show it to Miguel, he'll know what it is, he'll understand it. Uh, I know that uh, Jason's coming here on Saturday to film those videos with yeah. you. Yeah. That might be a good time to, to see the Derek stuff. Three episodes, the money making mindset, champion trifecta, the target marketing. Sounds like a good podcast. I would definitely be listening. <laughs> You got one of you. Nice. <laughs> you got proof. You got confident. What else makes you an expert? Hey, keto. Sushi, I mean. Why are you eating that? I'm bulking. Mmm. Why aren't you doing keto bowl? I'm trying to do a little bit faster. I actually don't think it's faster. Because science would say otherwise. Show me that science. Let me, let me learn something. You could be an astronaut without going to space. Really? Yeah. Do all the tests, get certified, get the, get the fucking license to go to space. Mm -hmm. You call yourself an astronaut. I guess it's not the same level of astronaut as not. one who's been to space. It's definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> There's no doubt about that. That's, that's, that's the point we can agree on. Levels. I'm about to do this uh, podcast with Connor Murphy. The Adonis podcast. If you ain't watching that shit. You tripping. The things about this book is uh, the CEO of Salesforce, nine figure company. Mm. And he's just talking about his, how he built it, and shit he had going on. He built a hundred million dollar company. I don't like Salesforce. I was talking to the salespeople with my card out, ready to purchase, and he like talking me out of it. All right, uh, we got that meeting with those guys today. Is there anything you want me to say or not say? I mean, it's simply just that we want to do a, yeah. a course like, like we do. Yeah. Yeah, that's how it be, man. He was, he was, he was sitting on that shit. He was just waiting. I've, I, I've done that before. What you, you wait for people to be, be famous and blackmail them? Not the blackmail. So back when I was in the music, I had this uh, song with this kid I went to college with. His kid name was Brandon Hines, and we did this dope ass song together. And it was like a really good song. And I was like, then he got signed to Jermaine Dupri's record label, So So Deaf in Atlanta. And I was like, oh cool. As soon as he puts his shit out. I'm gonna put this song out and I'm gonna be I'm gonna be able to ride his way. Got into he got heavily into drugs. <laughs> and uh his career took a downward spiral and that album never came out. Uh, I did it again with another with a rapper, this dude named Troy Ave, and we did a song together. He never really got famous. <laughs> he's about as famous uh -huh. as he's ever gonna be. He, he's actually most famous for shooting up a club called Irvine Cla Plaza in New York like two years ago. This this popular like podcaster, he had one of the most popular hip hop podcasts, this dude named Tax Stone, right? And Tax was always trolling. I'm saying he's a fake gangster and like his shit is a lie, he ain't never sold coke. And then he said, yo, next time I see you, I'm fucking you up. So Troy saw him and he approached him and then, and then I guess they started fighting. Tax pulled out a gun murdered Troy's best friend, man. Right, rest in peace, the banger. Troy got shot in the leg, taxed his gun from him, and then started chasing him around the club, shooting. 